here have a look about the projection of a body from the top of a tower and from the top of the tower uh, let us consider a body is projected vertically upward then what happens so here is a, a tower and uh, there is a body which is projected vertically upward from the top of the tower so this is the path of the body and it is uh, projected by a initial velocity u and now if you consider here this is the uh, height of the tower height of the tower h and from this position to maximum height uh, this is uh, the displacement made by the body that is x so if that is x and uh, this also will be some x and here this will be height of the tower now here i am considering that i am taking this as positive upward direction as positive and downward direction as negative so now the displacement displacement made by the particle s equal to see here it has started that means plus x and it came here so minus x and it reached ground now so minus h so if you cancel this minus x and plus x we will have s equal to minus h and the acceleration of the body a equal to minus g let us consider as we are projecting it upward a equal to minus g by taking the second equation of motion s equal to ut plus half at square so s is minus h and this is uh, ut minus g no a means minus g so minus half gt square and now uh, minus h equal to here you take minus common for this so this will become minus ut plus half gt square so now cancel this minus and minus so we are having h equal to minus ut plus half gt square and now let us write uh, rearrange this uh, equation like this uh, half gt square um, minus ut minus h see as this is plus h if you are taking uh, after that equal to it will be like this so this is equal to zero now if you compare this equation with a quadratic equation um, compare compare with the quadratic equation so what is the quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 so if you compare these two equations uh, we'll have like this and we know uh, this one also ax square plus bx plus c mm, this can be written as x equal to minus b plus or minus root over b square minus 4ac by 2a and now if you compare these two equations it is very clear that um, x square t square x t that means x is nothing but t and next if we compare a a equal to half g or uh, this can be written as g by 2 now and next if you compare what is b so b equal to minus u and c is nothing but minus h so now we, uh, if you substitute these values in this equation as x is t so t equal to minus b is nothing but minus u now so minus of minus u plus or minus root over b, b square means minus u whole square minus 4 a is g by 2 now g by 2 c is minus h by 
टू ही है ना सो टू इंटू जी बाय टू सिर्फ ही कैंसिल इस टू एंड टू एंड हियर आल्सो वी कैन कैंसिल टू इन फोर टू टाइम्स सो टाइम पी इक्वल टू माइनस इनटू माइनस प्लस यू प्लस और माइनस रूट ओवर माइनस यू होल स्क्वेयर इज यू स्क्वेयर माइनस टू जी माइनस एच सो इफ यू मल्टीप्लाई दिस बाय जी और दिस कैन बी रिटर्न एस टी इक्वल टू यू प्लस और माइनस रूट ओवर यू स्क्वेयर प्लस टू जी हेच माइनस इनटू माइनस प्लस टू जी हेच बाय जी सो दिस इज़ द टाइम टेकन बाय द बॉडी व्हिच इज़ प्रोजेक्टेड वेटिकली अपवर्ड फ्रॉम द टॉप ऑफ़ द टावर from the top of the tower if we project a body vertically upward then the time taken we will get the t equal to u plus or minus root over u square plus 2 g h by g